Kyle Martin Joyce wrapped himself around a telephone pole. He was 19 years old. This was a single car horrific accident with no witnesses. These are the facts that we've learned. Kyle was driving his little sports car, the one his mom helped him buy. A senior in high school, he had just finished his shift at McDonald's at 11 p.m. When the driver lost control of the vehicle, it hurt a curb and then the pole. Think of that perfect three-point turn, the perfect bank shot, like the shot that you would see in bumper pool. And there, the young man was pinned against the steering wheel and the wreckage caused by the impact of the pole. The speedometer stopped in place at 80 miles an hour while the cozy little town slept. Man, there was no drug and alcohol in his system. I am told that he said his name at the scene for the very last time on Valentine's Day, 1999. Kyle Martin Joyce. He spent five hours alone on the operating table. They needed 20 liters of blood, but the trauma, oh the trauma. The trauma was so extensive, none of his organs could be harvested. And yes, he was an organ donor. What a waste. A young man who wanted to serve his country, he'd already enlisted. What a waste. What a strong, smart, good-hearted young man, gone long before his time. What a waste, what a heartbreak.